Alexandra Weber with Fasteners here at NECA 2022 with Brennan Mock, Product Manager with Milwaukee Tool. Now Milwaukee has a solution for each step of the electrical installation process and Brennan is going to be walking us through. So Brennan, take it away. Yep, so one of those first steps is gonna be conduit bending. Uh, we reached out to users and understood what some of their frustrations were with their existing hand benders today and found a few key areas that we could innovate on. First of which is gonna be a double bolted handle. Uh, we found out that users were constantly having to tighten or re-bolt re to put a second bolt into their actual conduit benders. Additionally, we found that all of your markings were wearing off, so we've got big, bold black markings on here, so you can easily see exactly where you're bending, in addition to a reinforced foot pedal. Awesome. What's next? So we're looking at our new air tip back accessories that we just recently launched. Uh, this is going to be for pulling jet line uh, through close system conduit, either PVC or rigid. We've got three different back tip accessories. We've got a uh, half inch to one inch uh, tip, as well as a inch and a half to, or inch and a quarter, inch and a half, uh, as well as your two to four inch solution. So it's fairly simplistic. All you have to do is just set it up into the conduit itself, hook up the hose. Then you got your line pulled. All these accessories are gonna be compatible with inch and a quarter, inch and seven eighths, and two and a half inch diameter vacuum hoses. So no matter which vacuum brand you have, uh, they're gonna be compatible with it. All right, Brennan, show us what's next. So we've got all of our hand tool fish tape solutions. We've got a full line of tapes from 25 foot all the way to 240 foot, as well as non-conductive polyester with a number of different tip varieties. Uh, these are gonna have the smoothest payout for your easiest fishing uh, and most durable tape uh, when it comes to our non-conductive polyester. What's next? Uh, next, we're gonna take a peek at our uh, M18 Fuel Angler uh, to be able to kind of supplement your hand tool fishing and making it a little bit easier. Let's check it out. So with our M18 Fuel Angler, this is designed to be a powered hand tool fish tape replacement. We've got three different interchangeable cartridges. We've got a 100 foot polyester, 120 foot steel, and 240 foot steel. Uh, this is designed to take away that manual effort of having to feed out for long runs and being able to then pull it back. Like I mentioned, the cartridges are interchangeable, so in the event you need to switch, pull out the cartridge, swap from either polyester or 240 foot steel to 120 foot steel, or just swap out your 120, 240 foot steel cartridge and replace with a new one. So now that we've finished wire pulling, we're gonna head on over to panel preparation uh, and demo some of our step drill bits as well as our knockouts. Let's do it. So Brennan, we're finished pulling the wire. How are we now going to prep the panel for install? Yep, so now we need to drill a pilot hole for our knockout. We've got a number of different solutions that we offer. Most recently we've launched our cobalt step bits. These are designed for stainless steel primarily, but will give you extreme life in mild steel. Uh, as well as we've got our impact rated duty step bits. Uh, these are designed and optimized to be used in an impact. And we've seen a lot of users really start to trend more towards using their impact for pretty much any and every application. So I'll do a quick demo of this here in the panel. <laughs> So here we've got our 10 ton and six ton knockouts. 10 ton has capacities of up to six inch in mild steel, four inch in stainless. Our six ton is able to go up to four inch in mild, two inch in stainless. Uh, in addition to that, we've completely separated the weight of the tool from the punch die. So you're able to get everything set up in your panel uh, without having to balance the weight of the tool, plus the head, plus the punch and die. So it's a very quick and easy setup. Then all you have to do is hook your tool and go. Go ahead and release. 
the best part about this system is there's a rapid reset quarter turn, drop your slug, and then you're back in. Ready to punch the second hole. All of our punches and dies are dual rated for both mild and stainless steel, so you no longer have to buy a completely separate set just to be able to do stainless. Great. What's the last part of the installation process? Yep, so the last part is gonna be our cable installation where we will cut, strip, crimp, and torque your connector on down to your equipment. Let's check it out. All right, Brennan, our panel has been prepped. Now we need to prep the wire. Can you show us Milwaukee's solution for that? Yep, so first thing we have to do is be able to cut that wire to size. We have two main cutting solutions. We have our M12 cable cutter. Uh, this is designed to replace your hand ratchet style cable cutters today. It's got two speeds, one for your uh, smaller wires and then speed two for your large diameter wires. This will cut up to 600 MCM copper, 750 aluminum. And then our M18 solution here, this is the inline design, uh, meant to be able to replace those large lopping style uh, cable cutters you see today. Uh, cut up to 750 MCM copper, 1000 aluminum. Uh, you have an open jaw as well as a rotating uh, head here. So anywhere where you can fit your hand, you can make a cut. So now that we've cut our cable to length, now we need to be able to strip it and prep it for that lug. We offer two solutions, our M18 and M12 solution with capacities of from one out all the way to 750 for both copper and aluminum, THHN, XHHW type insulation. Effortless clean strips every single time. All right, so now that we've cut and stripped our wire to length, uh, we've got to be able to get ready to crimp it. So we've got a number of different crimping solutions that we offer today. We have our six ton, 600 MCM crimper. Uh, with the standard jaw, we'll give you capacities of up to 600 MCM copper, 350 aluminum. With our expanded jaw, you can get all the way up to 750 MCM copper as well as aluminum. It's a lightweight inline design, again with that pivoting head, allowing you to access uh, in pretty much any orientation. Additionally, we also offer a cut, cutting jaw to be able to cut and crimp your cable so you can have two tools in one. Next up is gonna be our 12 ton solution. Our 12 ton solution again is this is our do everything. So you can pretty much crimp any connector on the market today. Uh, it's the lightest, most balanced, most ergonomic 12 ton crimper on the market today. Again, with capacities of number eight, all the way up to 750 for both copper and aluminum. And then lastly, we have our single point dialist tool. This is both a pressure and distance based system. Uh, it has a linear and distance coded RAM so that every single time that that RAM makes uh, connection with the connector. It takes a reading to understand what size connector you're actually crimping, and it understands that it needs to go to a certain distance as well as achieve a certain pressure in order to have a good crimp. All of our crimpers are gonna be UF classified across seven major connector manufacturers, giving you the ability to choose and not necessarily uh, cycle into one single connector. All right, so we just finished our cable termination, Brennan. Now we're looking at the final step of the installation process. Can yep. you show us what we have? It's actually connecting and torquing down onto your equipment. We offer our M12 Fuel Digital Torque Wrench. Uh, this allows you to eliminate two tools in one, your impact driver impact wrench, as well as your torque wrench. We got it all in one solution. We offer this both in a 3 8 drive as well as a half inch. 3 8 drive here will be able to torque down to 100 foot pounds. You can save your crimps and be able to report every single torque lug onto your equipment to an inspector. Awesome. As you can see, Milwaukee has a solution for every step of the electrical installation process. For more information on any of these tools that Brandon showed us today, feel free to check us out on fasteneruslv.com.